Hey guys, this is Level 1 Online, and I wanted to make a quick video. Uh, two quick things on how to disable the run command when you're loading up a ROM, and then also if you want to disable Bluetooth and Wi Fi functionality to your Raspberry Pi. So, what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and launch our PuTTY. We're going to go ahead and log in. We're going to type in Retro Pi. We're going to log in as Pi. Password is Raspberry. We're going to go ahead. We're going to type in sudo space period slash capital R retro capital P Pi dash setup another slash retro pie all one word lowercase this time underscore setup dot sh and I'll put that command in the description so you can just copy and paste it go ahead and push enter all right let me move this to the center of the screen we're gonna go ahead and go to manage packages manage core packages and right here here's the four main programs RetroArch emulation station retro pi menu and run command I'm gonna go ahead and hit OK um, we're gonna go here to configuration and options hit OK on mine I already have it disabled uh, but what you would do this is where you can just toggle it on and off just hit enter that's how you disable it once you finish hit the right arrow hit cancel make sure it says disabled Go ahead and go back a screen and then go ahead and go back another screen go ahead and exit it'll bring us back to our command prompt and then to go ahead and edit the uh, what we have to do now to disable the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth we're gonna go ahead and type in sudo nano slash boot slash config dot txt all right so right here this is the uh, config dot txt file now another easy way to do this is you can remove the SD card from your Raspberry Pi uh, make sure you power it off first go ahead connect it back into the computer and your computer can actually you can open this file it'll it's one of the files that your computer can read off of the uh, card directly and you can just if you want to edit it through your own text editor uh, but these uh, commands right here this is where actually I went to disable uh, overscan what I did is I removed the uh, the pound symbol so if you want to re-enable it you just go ahead and hit the uh, the pound symbol See right there okay and this is also where if you have issues with your uh, if you're using if you want to manipulate the HDMI modes uh, this is where you can go right here and there is a website and I'll make sure to see if I can link that as well so if you can do some reading up on that and there's other uh, parameters and stuff that you can manipulate I haven't had a chance to go through all of these and study them so at the bottom what I've added is two lines of text it is D T overlay equal sign pi 3 dash disable dash Wi-Fi and then on the next line it's D T overlay equal sign Pi 3 dash disable dash BT for Bluetooth okay and then what you do from there is you hit control and X save modified buffer uh, hit the Y button for yes and then go ahead and push enter to confirm and that's it Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm probably going to have to put out another video uh, coming soon. The image I just released, I did identify an issue. So I'll go ahead and talk about that in the next video. Take care.